Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and it's time for another recipe from the recipe box. Today's recipe is zucchini bread. Now I knew there was a reason why I bought these zucchinis when I was in Costco yesterday. And you know what? I thought it was for having a saute, but you know what? We need two cups of unpeeled shredded zucchini for this recipe. Yes, I do believe that's a that's a solid packed two cups of zucchini. All right, we'll be back when I get the other stuff together. And we have one cup each of chopped pecans and raisins. All right, we're kind of doing this old school because my my mixers are on the island. My island's surrounded by boxes for a yard sale this weekend, so. We're sticking to the counter for now. Now, we're going to put three cups of flour into the sifter. One teaspoon of cinnamon. One, whoops, that's a little too much. One teaspoon of baking soda. One teaspoon of baking powder. And a pinch of salt. We're going to sift this together. I'm going to I just bought a bag of flour from Costco and I could not afford, uh, well, they didn't have organic flour, so there you go. So I had to buy just all purpose. That's okay. Alrighty. Now, it tells us here, in a large bowl, stir together flour, sugar, cinnamon, salt, baking powder, so baking powder Soda, zucchini, nuts, and raisins. Okay, that's everything but the eggs and oil, isn't it? So, flour and seasonings. Sugar. And zucchini. And the raisins and the nuts. There, let's try this. We can do this on slow. Just kind of mix this all up together. You know, this says one nine by three, um, one bread pan. I think I'm going to get out my double one. Now it tells us to mix our oil and eggs together. I'm just going to use the zucchini cup for that. Beat them together. Now it says to pour this all over the top of this sort of wet dry mixture. Three eggs, one cup of oil. Wow, is this ever heavy stuff? Make sure we get all the sugar and the flour off the bottom. I'm getting my bigger pan out here because I don't think one single bread pan was going to do this justice. Yeah, this is a heavy duty recipe. It's going into a 350 degree oven 
for an hour and a half. Okay, our timer has gone off. Oh, this is beautiful zucchini bread. Let's just have a look. Let's just have a check here. Hour and a half, right on the money. Now it says to let this sit in the pan for 10 minutes and then turn it out onto a cake rack. All right, Howie's home, but he's not in the house yet, so I'm going to cut into this. Now this doesn't feel like regular zucchini bread. Look at it. It's not that heavy. It's beautiful and heavy and moist, but it's not, um, it's not green with it. You're just going to have to put up with my thumbs up. And I, I've already tasted it, so. Mm. Mm. It's not overly sweet, but it's rich and delicious without being over sweet. Really, really hearty. Zucchini bread from the recipe box.